In this video, I'll show you how to fix the unable to reach Adobe servers issue in the Creative Cloud application. So the very first thing we will need to do is check our firewall settings, which you can do by heading over to the start menu and searching for Windows Defender, and then tap on the Windows Defender tab, and come over to allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall, and press change settings at the top here, and come down to allow another app. Click on browse, and we need to locate the Creative Cloud executable file. If you're not sure where that's saved, then head into your C drive, inside of program files x86, inside of the Adobe folder, come into Adobe Creative Cloud, inside of account, and select the creativecloud.exe, and then you can press add to add it to the list. Once you've added it to the list, just make sure both private and public are ticked here, and then come into allow another app one more time, select browse, and now we're gonna press this up arrow to come back one folder, come inside of utils, and this time we're gonna select the Creative Cloud desktop app, and once again, you can select add, and then once again, just make sure both private and public are ticked, and we can press OK to save our changes. You can then close out of this window, and next thing we need to do is come to our start menu and search for CMD. Then you need to right click on command prompt and make sure to run as administrator. Inside of here, you need to type in the following commands, net sh space winsock space reset, and hit enter. And then lastly, you can type in ipconfig space slash flush DNS, and hit enter. And you can then head out of this window and check to see if that's fixed the issue. Now, if that's still not working for you, the next thing you can do is come to the start menu and search for settings and tap on the settings icon, come inside of network and internet, inside of VPN, and you just need to make sure you're disconnected from any VPN you might be connected to just by pressing this disconnect button. As you can see, I'm not currently connected to anything, but if that still doesn't solve the issue, the very last thing we need to do is head over to an internet browser and you need to come over to the Adobe website and I'll leave a link to this page in the video description and scroll all the way down here to this reset your host file section and we need to download the limited access repair tool. So just simply click on the link and once you've downloaded it then we need to double click it to launch it and then just go through these steps to install it onto your computer. Click on accept and just let the tool run and this is going to try and identify any problems with your application and it will automatically resolve these for you. And if that still doesn't work for you the very last thing that we can do is head over to our start menu and search for programs then tap on add or remove programs and I would recommend completely uninstalling the application by heading down to Adobe Creative Cloud coming over to these three little dots and hitting uninstall. We can then reinstall the application via the website and hopefully that should have solved any issues you're experiencing. If you still are experiencing problems, then please drop a comment below and I'll try my best to assist you. If this video did help you, then please drop a like and subscribe. Until next time.